Hello and good evening to you. Doctors with UW Medicine say the goal of this study is to figure out how effective and how long the vaccines work with the virus and its mutations, and they're also looking for a few unvaccinated participants. Studies. So the primary um, endpoints, we will be looking at safety and tolerability of the vaccine, but we will also be looking at immune response. Dr. Tia and Babu from the University of Washington of is heading up a local study looking at the long-term effectiveness of the coronavirus vaccine. We don't know how long people have immunity after vaccination. Uh, we don't know over time, will that immunity wane? And we don't really um, know how, we do know that some of the vaccines are less effective against different variants. UW Medicine is among four health groups participating in the study, which is expected to last just over a year. And they're looking for people who haven't been vaccinated yet, along with other criteria. Uh, we're looking for people who don't have a lot of medical um, diagnoses, who don't have um, any risk for severe COVID, and for people who don't have a severe allergy profile as well. Dr. Babu says the study is important to address future vaccine effectiveness against the mutating variants of the virus. We do want to see if we can elicit a broader immune response. Is it too early to say that, yes, this is going to be something that's like a flu shot, or is that what this study is aiming to find out? So it's possible that we could end up doing that for coronavirus as we see mutations, but I think it's too early to tell and too early to tell how long immunity lasts after vaccination. So again, they are only looking for a small number of, of participants and you cannot have already been vaccinated. But if you text the word study to 206-448-4545, we will send you a link with that contact information. For now here live in Seattle, I'm Tony Black, King 5 News. Tony, thank you.